So just woken up from a lovely night's sleep. Didn't even feel like I was in the van last night. It was literally class. Felt like I was at home, like proper bed at home. And look, take a look at the windows. Like they're proper clear as well. And I think what's happened is I put the ventilation mode on, on the planar heater. It's just like kept the air like so clear in it. It's lovely. I think that was partly down to that as well. But what we're going to do is get up soon and do some more exploring or something. He's just got out of his bin bag, look. I think it started raining last night as well. It's a good job he was underneath the awning, otherwise it would have been a lot worse. All right, anyway. What's up? What's up? What's up? How was it? What do you mean how was it? It was like a bin bag. Was it? So we can have a nice cup of tea and coffee. Got the old kettle out there. Packing up now, I've been told to move on. Within half an hour. Because I think we was meant to stay at a different part of the site, but we ended up staying here because it's the best spot. But hey ho. These things happen. Well, we, we've been kicked out of this one. Been nicking other campers' okay. spots. Mm -hmm. We've had hookups. <laughs> yeah, he took the post out. Um, yeah, it's been nice though. I don't think we're going to stay again because I haven't got any chocks on the van. I need to get some chocks. Mm -hmm. Maybe level. Yeah, because it's not it's not that level. So we need to go and find somewhere we can get some chocks, level the van out. Maybe get you know. I mean, look, you can see here this pitch is very downhill. Yeah, and I weren't opting for that. I pretended I was just to get in, but once we were in, oh, we better go and pay him anyway. Um, Travella. There's probably a few people on my YouTube that have been there. But it's quite a popular site. Nice idea, though. It's like you're going places with them tyres. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, will be. Um, do we, we want to square up for... For, for last night, that's possible. There you go. There you go. Uh, Today, uh, full, full tea. There, there you go. Thank you. Oh. It's a sign. I, I thought it. I thought it lost the. Um, <laughs> I thought it. You know what happened the other day with the uh, the gear linkage. I lost the gear linkage. It come off. So I thought it was that. Right, yeah, we're going to do that then. Let's get a move on. Have you got your... Nice stay trip? though. It's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. To be, did they say everyone has come back? Tonight? Yeah, she said if you want to come back, we can do. Did you say, can we have a... Can we, we won't cause the new hassle again? No, I so just... So we're booking an electric one straight up. I just said that uh, <laughs> they didn't mind. They were loving it. Loving it. They were like, uh, come back before six and then we'll be all good. Right, straight better put up. the camera away now because I'm coming off of private property. Goodbye. <laughs> Oh, I've just pulled up at a, it looks like a solar panel field. <laughs> don't they do a CCTV operator? Goes off the gate. I don't think they want you to park here, but I need to have a shower. And obviously we got off of that site quite quick. They wanted us to move because we were in someone else's um, pitch. So I'm going to pull over, have a quick shower and carry on with our, <laughs> with our journey. We're in a really nice spot here. Bit of wild camping. Yeah, they've got some power there, haven't they? What do you think it is? Don't know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Quick shower outside. Oh, mate, that is cold. Jeez, it must be mental, mate. That water's freezing as well, isn't it? Oh. <laughs> do that air, son. <laughs> what a place to do it as well. <laughs> right in front of the uh, the solar farm. Lovely bit of solar farm. Yeah, sweet. Uh, all freshed up now. Nice shower. Um, yeah. Start packing up. <laughs> Move on. I think. What are we doing today, then, Geese? What, what, what do we fancy? The weather's not saying much, is it? No, that's boring at the moment. But the end of the day, it didn't get hot till about ten, did it? No. It was down the beach, like. Wouldn't mind a bit of a swim again on the beach, but. It's grey, don't look that fun. 
Hmm. Ready to make a move now. Hung the shorts up, just to let them dry out. Not a bad idea. I'm not sure how long they're going to take to dry though in this weather. It shouldn't take too long. Fuel's low, need a quick stop. Taking a walk down to Padstow Harbour, gonna go and get some fish and chips. You have to excuse the quality of this footage because GoPro batteries died again, as always. Um, so it's currently on charge in the van. 32 for a long do you like lobster? Not for me, I've never even eaten it. So it's like the sun from that keen on. Well, it's proper busy down there. We're going to go to Rick Stein's uh, fish and chip shop. Apparently, it's meant to be quite good. You can check that out. Literally. Rick Story like, owns pretty much everything in this town. He owns a whole of Cornwall, apparently. <laughs> a whole of Pad Stein. They call it Pad Stein. It's well known around there. Pad Stein. But we're going to go and check that out. Um, yeah. Let you know what it's like. The problem with having a long wheelbase one. Just getting that out. <laughs> How long was that wait? Half an hour? Quite quite, oh my god, gauges. The queue is absolutely massive as well. The time we finished, can't wait to tuck into it. So, we didn't get like fish and chips, we've got a spicy fish burger with chips as well. Check that out. Turn the camera around. Like I'm really enjoying the, the burger, it looks really, really tasty. Just check that burger out. <laughs> Just a view behind me. <laughs> anyway, yeah, no, it's nice food. A bit spicy, but I love it. Love it, spicy. You can't have the garlic sauce as well. Yeah. We'll run your chops. Yeah, perfect. Food down at Rick Stein's was amazing. Had a spicy fish burger with chips and the garlic mayo. Really recommend that. Good shout. Sat on the harbour. The guy with the boat, funny enough, he started chatting to us. He was a T5 owner as well. Um, spoke to him for about half an hour. He's telling us about his boat. His sailboat, it looked really cool. He'd sailed down from Wales, didn't realise you could go that far from Wales to down here on one of those things, but yeah. Uh, good fun, I think someone's waiting for my parking space, but I'm not actually leaving, so they're gonna have to keep waiting. <laughs> James has currently gone to the toilet, um, then he's gonna come back, and then I think we're gonna find another good area to go and check out. Um, and yeah do a bit more footage a bit annoying about my gopro battery dying because i had to take the last bit of footage on my phone which you can tell the quality isn't that great but anyway let's crack on i've come to tesco there's about 30 spaces next to me safety numbers look look at this one right there he's got another five spaces he could have parked further on and the same with this lot here um parked right up close but they could have parked in the other spots but this is what people like to do they like to come as close as they can so they can bang your doors i hate supermarkets and people just thought i'd put that out there look at this for a car park This before a bit of parking. It's amazing down in Cornwall. 
Wish we had this down in Sussex. There's nothing like this. So many other V dubs as well. It's literally loads. Harlem Beach, apparently it's surfers paradise. Harlem Bay. Bloody hell, look at that drop. Check this out. I'm going to get too close to the edge because that means I won't be able to upload this video. <laughs> Absolutely mental around there. It's lovely. I didn't realise really how nice Cornwall is. Um, I always think most of the UK looks the same, but this is pretty different to most of the places I've been to. have a look at what's, what's going on here. James is being a photographer. I'm just chilling having a beer over the edge. <laughs> look at this. <laughs> Weather's changed so quick. Like within two minutes, look at it. It's gone like proper misty now. Don't mind though, I'm loving this spot here. It's chilling. It's like we're on a bus. James is sat a few rows behind. <laughs> on his dog and bone again. He loves his dog and bone. Can't be taken in that sea, yeah. It's getting the best bone in the face. Lush, proper fresh air here. Right, we're leaving this place now. We're going to go back to Bodmin. We like it there. We like the campsite. We're going to have a chilled night down there. I was going to go and do a night out in Nuki, but change our minds. Go and relax. I've got chocolate all over my mouth. Walking up a main road in Bodmin. Right, so if I pop the flag, 500 pounds. No, no, no. I'm going to pop the flag. I gave, I gave you a chance. He's going to give me five pounds a month. No. Ten years. It's 600 pounds. I, I get. Over a thousand euros. It's a hundred pound interest. It's no, alright, it's not. No, 50, no, 50p every ten euros. <laughs> Come on, Jamie. 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 Come on, I'm a millionaire now. Yes, thank what a gentleman, John. Thank you, mate. It took ages to get through. I bet it did. Cheers, John. I've got a little sound again. A little sound again. And you won't finish. Right, you probably can't see a thing now. Me and James are walking back. Hello. What are we on? We're on a single carriageway. It's frosty, it's cold, it's dark. The taxis aren't taking anyone, but we're walking back to our campsite. Um, we've been playing pool tonight. We've had a few drinks at Weather Spoons. We found a pool club, played pool there. Uh, played with some old guy called John, Sound Geezer. I beat him, I also beat James. James beat John. Oh, did, did James beat John? No, John beat you, didn't he? No. I think I've got that on video, I'm gonna put that on later. Uh, <laughs> but overall, it was a good night. So just walking back to the campsite, down a few glasses of water, maybe have a, another beer or something. But the time now, what is it, 10 to 1? 10 to 1, we're just gonna make our way back. Um, that's gonna be it for tonight. I don't think there's gonna be any more footage because my GoPro is still at home, or I say still at home, still in the van, uh, charging. I wonder if it's charged now, I doubt it. But even if it was, it's irrelevant because I ain't got it on me. Then I'll do another video, probably on the way back. See you all again soon.